in February, this February, we had a class on reincarnation. Yeah. And when I say class, it is. It's a class. It's a class. <laughs> yes. And in a class, you enter into the class having uh, maybe some idea what you're going to talk about. Mm-hmm. And by the end of the class, it should get information in that class that some notes. expands your ideas and your thoughts and your knowledge and your insights around whatever the thing is that the class is about. It's like, you shouldn't get to the end of the class and say, oh yeah, I knew that, I knew that, I knew that. Mm -hmm. There should be something in there that you didn't know. Right. And there was stuff in there that I didn't know. That was uh, in spite of the fact that I was helping give the class. And prepared it together. And prepared it together (laughs) through the process of giving the class. Insights that I didn't even know came, which was pretty damn cool. Do you remember what... What it was? Well, it had to, had to do in specific with uh, the energy people carry of, I ain't never coming back here again. Mm-hmm. Right? And in their meaning of that, their meaning of that, their reincarnation, meaning of the reincarnation, becoming aware of why they reincarnate and why they would, uh, would keep it um, a mystery to themselves or a hidden from themselves. Mm-hmm. The, the whole why, the why they keep it a cycle that they, quote, unquote, don't have control over. Mm, right. So yeah. that they do come back here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But not come back here, come back to a light, dark paradigm. Yes, come back to a light, dark paradigm. Because if they had a good recall, they, they, <laughs> they exactly wouldn't. And their <laughs> yes. energy that they carry, which right now is, there ain't no way I'm coming back here. Uh-huh. Is true. They're not coming back here. here. But what do they mean by here is not this whole Gaia planet uh, thing. They mean light, dark paradigm. They do. But the words they use, they generally speak of, is Earth, Earth, and this, right? Yeah. This place, like this place, can be like this forever. Yeah. So through the exploring reincarnation, finding out that, well, you never die, mm-hmm. and you don't change person when you do die, mm-hmm. because you didn't die. Right. And that the memories that you have, you still have them, mm-hmm. right? And they still define you. And they still define you. And, well, there was probably four or five other things, but I, if you're interested in that topic, you really should get that class. Mm-hmm. It also gives a lot of value to the life that we're actually living. Because oh, man, yeah. <coughs> I found a lot of people... We'll talk about, oh, you never really die, right. you know, so don't worry about it. Right, right. But that kind of gives an energy of, oh, it's fine, you know, I can Just live this life and I'm not going to die really, and I want to. So it's kind of, it, they do integrate that part of it, which I think is kind of a hijacking of the whole thing. It is, yes. Because you, your life, how you planned it at the higher self level uh, is totally worth living, living it. it. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yes. So it's not like, here's the key, get the hell out of here. Mm-hmm. It's like, here's the key, make it count while you're here. As a person who has been um, has a lineage of helping people through the valley of death, mm-hmm. um, I have found that with suicides, you know, like religious doctrine or some other doctrines, they'll say that the person's going to be punished in some religions, the person's not allowed to be buried in this regular cemetery. They have to be outside of the cemetery. And they say that they're going to go to hell and all sorts of stuff, right? In different religions. And when I looked at individuals who committed suicide, the main, I would say 99% of the time, when they committed suicide, that moment when they reached the other side, the energy was, oops. Oops. <laughs> oops. Oops. Uh, uh, oops. That was it, you know? That was the energy. And in um, all of the cases that I saw, I mean, some of them were like, hey, you know, actually I planned it this way, blah, blah, blah. And they had their reasons and whatevers. It was never like, um, you know, there was, it was more like, I gave up on oopsie, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It was like, I wish I'd stayed and figured this out. Right, right. And I'm going to go back by choice to, to the same state I was in and then continue where I left off. Because you're still the same you. 
Exactly, yeah. Yeah. So. Exiting, exiting the scenery didn't exit the you. No. It no. just put the you in different scenery. Right. Basically, right. right. Yeah. So that was a super great <laughs> class.